Hey guys, today I'll be doing a review of my 16 ounce custom uh, Sabas um, Pro Bag Gloves. As you can see, they are uh, a custom color. I got the white, red, and gold scheme. I've actually had these gloves for quite a while now, for several months. Uh, they've been thrown into my rotation as far as just doing work at the gym. Um, I got these through uh, Pedro, who is the owner of Sabas. And um, kind of wanted to give you guys my experience with these gloves and just how they look, uh, how they feel, and um, just the overall quality of them. You can see I got the uh, Filipino stars right there on the front, in custom yellow. Um, let me just take these off real quick, kind of give you an overview of these. So um, These are 16 ounce. They're basically the same as the blue and black uh, Pro Bag Glove reviews that I did, um, that I have, but there's a couple of improvements that they've made with this glove. Um, one mainly being the liner, but the actual um, the padding on it's the same, and just the overall construction is the same. So um, I love these gloves. Um, the first thing I want to say off of these gloves are just um, awesome gloves. Probably the most comfortable um, for the quality and the price you pay for these. You can't beat them. I feel that they're comparable to um, you know Grant and Winning and Reyes in their own way. They're kind of a combination between a little bit of everything like that with the comfort of the thumb placement and then the, the quality of the leather. And then um, obviously the, the customization, you can get the cool colors. So I like that and you can get it for a relatively good price. So I know depending on what you get, you know, anywhere, I think it ranges from anywhere from like 120 to up to like $200, just depending on what kind of uh, leather you use, if you use using metallics, uh, what color, if you use a different kind of skin, if you go with like reptile skin, I think they do that as well. Like, um, so you can do a lot of different customizations and, and that'll obviously affect the price. Um, so again, I got these in the uh, gold, uh, red and white. Um, awesome quality leather. Again, the same as my other gloves. Nice and thick. Um, these are Mexican made, made in Mexico, so they're not a Pakistani glove. Um, you have that nice attached thumb. The stitching on it, it's all on point. Um, the metallics are, are, are is just awesome. This video probably doesn't do it a very, very good job of showing you how nice the metallic color is, but it doesn't do uh, justice. But the metallic is very nice. Um, you can see these really pop. You get a lot of compliments with these gloves. So stitching is all on point. Colors nice. I like that, the fact that the the leather strap is not that. Um, Elastic material is all leather, 100% uh, with the Velcro. So you can also get the larger, I believe, the foreign strap, similar to like what Grant has, where it's the kind of the, the double wrap around. But I prefer these better. This three-inch strap is just better and easier to use. You have that elastic in the middle. Um, you have your standard polyester lining. Now this is the, the difference that they've made. Um, is the inside uh, lining uses they use now. It, is more of it like a uh, nylon polyester, so it wicks the, wicks the moisture away a little bit better. When you put your hand into this hand compartment about halfway up, you can actually feel, I don't even know how to explain it, it almost feels like silk um, in the knuckle area. So in the knuckle and the finger compartment, uh, almost has kind of a silky feel to it. So really nice. You can make a great fist with the glove, so they have a nice broken in feel. My favorite part about these gloves is that they're the perfect size. They're not too big, they're not too small. So they allow room for, for people with all kinds of uh, shaped hands. I have medium to small shaped hands and they fit real nice, good and snug. Not too, not too tight with my hand wraps on. And the thumb placement is perfect. I don't feel like my thumb is, is jamming into the glove and it's very comfortable in that respect. Um, the, the wrist protection is really good. Um, obviously it doesn't compare to if you got lace-up gloves, lace-ups are probably the way to go uh, when it comes to actual wrist protection, but the, the Velcro does a nice job of locking your wrist in. Um, has good flexion to it, not too much. And I like the, the padding they use here along the wrist so that when you lock, when you lock the Velcro in, it really makes a good, nice tight fit to it. So some, sometimes other gloves this part along with the wrist area, they just put like this thin, cheap piece of foam. So when you lock your wrist in, it doesn't feel very good. It feels really flimsy with these. So you can feel that they put a lot of padding inside there. 
And then my favorite thing about the gloves is the actual feedback from hitting the heavy bag or doing mitt work. These are a kind of like a comfort, both a, 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 a protective glove, but they also you also get kind of the feedback that you would with a, a, a puncher's glove, like a Reyes glove, but with the protection. So it's kind of the best of both worlds. You can really throw hard shots and land them on the heavy bag and really dig in and you don't feel it in your wrist and in your knuckles. You just feel that nice pop. Um, so that's my favorite thing about these gloves is the fact that you get a little bit of both. You get both protection. Um, it doesn't completely break down the, the actual um, padding. It doesn't just collapse when you hit the bag so your knuckles get sore, but it also gives you that nice crack when you hit the bag as well. So overall, very excellent gloves, man. These are probably my favorite right now, part of my rotation. Um, you can reach out uh, to Sabas Fight Gear. I'll put the link on the uh, video description if you guys want to reach out to them, or should I say reach out to Pedro. But again, excellent gloves. Um, definitely my favorite. If you guys have any questions about it, feel free to reach out.